Well, we begin tonight with some breaking news out of the capital city. Several school buses in the Providence school bus yard damaged by fire. Good evening. I'm Mike Montecalvo. And I'm Shannon Heggy. School bus drivers have been picketing there as they continue their strike, which has been going on for more than a week now. But we should stress there's no information to suggest a connection here. Let's get right to eyewitness news reporter Sheena Lasciuto, who's live now in Providence. Sheena? Mike Shannon, we've been here for a couple of hours now, and just in the last half hour, we saw two fire trucks return to the scene. Now, we just got an update from officials. They tell us when firefighters first got here, one bus was totally engulfed in flames. Now, let's take a look at that. No, the call came in just after 7:30 tonight. At least seven buses have been impacted. It appears the fire spread fast. First student officials are on scene here tonight. This is the same bus company, like you guys said, that we've been reporting on for weeks, where the drivers in Providence are currently on strike. This is being treated as a criminal investigation. Here's what city officials are telling us tonight. We'll be here most of the night, probably throughout the night. We have some forensic work to do. And they're doing some a video review as well. That's going to take several hours. Of course, uh, it is suspicious, um, and uh, certainly, you know, the elephant in the room there. You know, the timing of it um, also is odd. Uh, but what we're going to do, we're going to do a full investigation. Now, officials have asked us to stay over here on this side of the yellow tape, but I can see officials investigating back there. This, of course, is still an active investigation. We will bring you the latest as we learn it on Eyewitness News this morning, starting at 4.30. For now, reporting live in Providence, I'm Sheena Loshudo, Eyewitness News.